Hello everybody, my name is Alpha Arceus and welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Life. We are going to continue. In the last episode, we had a doomstone crash into our roof and we had Hughes take it. Um, hold on, I'll be back because we already saw this. We're back to where we were and now we are, it's telling us to go to explore the grassy plains. But we are going to find that second doomstone and extract it before that Professor Hughes does. So let us go. Let's start running. So yeah. So yeah, by the way, I uh, just wanted to say I hope you guys are enjoying this Let's Play. I know I sure know I am. Uh, let's just get some apples, because apples are good for you. They restore HP, I do believe. And if you stop right... Whoops. Cutscene. You there! Me where? Did you hear someone shouting or am I antenna on the fritz? Antenna. Antenna. You didn't see me! You didn't see me! But I do see you. It's Captain Mustache! I mean Mustang! You there! Did you see a blue caped urchin? <clears throat> I mean, have you seen an... Oh, so charming and too fast for his own good young boy. Uh, yeah. Oh, whoops. <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, no, no, I mean, I don't know if I saw him. The one you're looking for, that is. But there is, there was a blur in a blue cap that ran past toward the town. Isn't that right, John? Wink. Thanks for the information and clear that dust note out of your eye. Dust moat out of your eye. You heard the talking butterfly back to town, boys. Sir, yes, sir, mustache, sir. See, they joke just like I do. Okay, they're gone. Thank you. Those men were quite rude. I started to think what would have transpired had they found me. Oh, wait a second. It's you. I saw you earlier in the town square. What are you doing? No, wait. Don't tell me. I'm quite good at this. You're out here picking apples. Well, actually, I just was picking apples. Are you are you stalking me? Stalker! Not quite. We're looking for the. No, no, don't tell me you are out here gathering dandelion puffs to make an eye pillow for a relative. Oh no! Wait, you're collecting donations to take to the Talking Insects Auxiliary, auxiliary Annual bo Bocce Tournament. It breaks my heart to stop you. Actually, we're looking for a doomstone. Isn't that right, John? Oh, splendid. That's what I'm doing now, too. I'm sure you wouldn't mind if I join... I'm sure you won't mind if I join up with you. Uh... Huh? Uh, well, sure, I guess. I mean, it doesn't sound like we have much of a choice. Ah, oh, a butterfly with a dry wit. How unique. Oh, thank you for helping me. John, is it? Well, shall we continue our search? Boy, join your party. Alright, as I was going to say before, I was rudely interrupted. If you go right here, you can get spring water. And if you pick up these leaves right here, you can get heel weaves. These are all used for alchemy, cooking, things like that. Right here, you can get some honey. Some grassland honey, that is. And then you could be off to the grassy plains. Can you confirm that a stone of doom was sighted in this location, Squire? Sure I can. I mean, the doomstone, right? It's right over there. But may I ask whose authority you, are you two here? Oh, that's an easy one. Me and my bro are here, or sent us to... Me... Uh, whatever. Or sent... Me and my bro here sent us here on authority. See, my bro is quite estimated in its profession. So we'll just be taking that stone if you don't mind. Just let me do the talking. You stand there and stick your chin out quietly. My good man, we are scholars under the tut tutelage of... God, I don't even know anymore. It's Monday. I'm Professor Hughes. I'm actually the professor's right-hand man, Pierre. And I'm his left-hand man, Butch. We've been under the professor's to the age... Un <laughs> to the age... Ever since we la ever since last week. Oh, really? Is that right? 
So, Professor Hughes just sent the two of you to take this extremely heavy doomstone back to the castle? Yeah, well, he wanted to send more guys, but we told him we got it. That's very d dutiful of you. Very well, then. Then you may help me pull the doomstone out of the ground first. Whoa, that thing weighs a ton, and I got glowing stuff all over my hands. Bro, this stone's all dirty, and it kind of stinks like rotten eggs. Are you sure it's really a treasure? Did you say that this is a treasure? Oh, no, no, my good man. My brother said he has said that serving Professor Hughes was a singular pleasure. And that he is excited to measure the stone, and when we're done, he's hoping for some leisure. Oh, he said all that just now? I thought he just said something about treasure. Well, be careful with it. It's for research, after all. Oh, of course. Why did you keep flapping your lips, Cabbage Head? You nearly blew the whole plan. Sorry, bro, I didn't mean to. Wait, what plan? The plan where we secure the Doomstone for ourselves and then sell it to Hughes for a fortune? But first things first, we need to stash it somewhere until we can ta take it to Hughes. Remember, that cave we found earlier? That would be the perfect place to hide, to hide this for, for the time being. I can't talk! My scheme is almost too immaculate. Yeah, and you made a good plan too. <laughs> it's a good thing! That there's totally not someone just watching your text so they won't know where you're going to put that doomstone. Eh. So where exactly is this doomstone supposed to have fallen? It should, it should be piled and stationed across the grassy plains. We can just ask one of them if they've seen anything. Search for the doomstone. Alright. So we're going to search for the doomstone. Alright, this is another a new enemy, Worker B, so we're going to defeat it. And, uh, so yeah, we do have a buddy with us now. You can hold at least two buddies in your team. Sorry for my dog's barking. So, yeah, um, yeah. <clears throat> By the way, oh, wait, never mind, I didn't show you that, because I can't. Dogs, be quiet! Actually, you know what, we can probably complete a quest here. Do you remember how, uh, the farmer said he wanted us to defeat Carities? Sorry for that random cut, and for my dogs barking, my dogs are stupid. But anyways, those were carrot carrotties or caradalas, I don't remember what they're called. Um, no, caradalas are the bigger ones. But those were carrotties, so we can defeat those for the mission. But right now, we're on the search for the the search for the Durnstone. That guy's sleeping. I don't see the Doomstone anywhere. Oh my god, hold on, I'll be back. Sorry about my dog, guys. I don't know what their problem is. This is like looking for a needle in a haystack. Maybe we should ask that guard over there. Now look at that. Disgraceful. What do you think the king would think about that? Ahem. <clears throat> Excuse me. Honestly, this is just unacceptable. Wake up, you! Huh? Was it? Forgive me, princess. Wait, what? I could have sworn I heard. What's going on here? And why is that butterfly staring at me? Tell us where the doomstone is, or we'll tell the king that you were snoozing on the job. What? No, you can't. I have a family. Well, I mean, not really. But I'm not married. But I do live with my mom. So please, don't tell anyone. The doomstone landed just over there by the bridge over there. Um, I think I heard that wrong. Thank you. No problem. Wait until my mom hears that I gave direction to a talking butterfly. She's gonna flip! Alright, thank you very much, sir. We will be going to get that doomstone. What's this? This can't be a doomstone, the doomstone crater. It looks like the outline of a person. That's not the doomstone crater. We knew that. Doomstone crater is over... <coughs> Done. So, what's this person shaped crater? Don't know. Maybe someone fell from the sky like some kind of flying angel. That doesn't fly too well anymore. <laughs> Is there anyone down in there? That thing looks pretty deep. It actually looks like just somebody face planted into the ground. This has to be some type of hoax. I mean, how could someone survive a fall from the sky? Yeah, uh, I mean, it's not like there's some sort of land up there in the clouds filled with people, right? Exactly. What's. But so where is the Doomstone now? It was collected by men sent by Professor Hughes. It was a pleasure for them to meet. to measure, and they wanted leisure. 
but they mention no treasure. They mention no treasure, just measure pleasure and leisure. No treasure, are you sure? Well met, Squire. Where is the doomstone? Point to me to it quickly. Quickly now. Oh, Professor Hughes, those men you sent already picked it up. Your right and left hand men took care of it all. What are you babbling about, man? I have no hand men in employ, left or right. But, but, they said they were under your tutelage. Now, how would they know how old my tutel is? This is bad. If the Doomstone gets into the wrong hands, the consequences could be catastrophic. Well, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I, uh, can't, actually, no, I kind of don't want to. I want to get to a safe point first. So, yeah, let's do that. What do you mean by catastrophic? Huh? What's that? Oh, it's you, from the smashed roof incident. What are you doing here? Do you have something to do with the life-risking incidents of a Doomstone? Don't be stupid. <gasps> I have never been stupid in my life. Especially not in front of a talking butterfly. You know, you would make a very good specimen. Is that a threat? Oh, on the contrary. It was a scientific wish, that's all. I will note you in my su in my research journal. But that is for another time. Right now, we must retrieve that doomstone. Onward, shoots. Let's go get that doomstone. Sir, yes, sir. Professor Hughes, sir. If one of you happens to find the stone, do be a dear and let me know what won't you tar. Did I mention what a jerk that guy is? Don't waste your time with Hughes. It's a lost cause. What, you know him? Eh, my father works with him sometimes. I would surmise that that those no good good Nick brothers are behind this. Come on, John, let's get that stone. All right, I'm gonna go to a safe point, which is actually, and I can't go that way because invisible walls. All right, so I'm just gonna get to a safe point. I'm just gonna run to a safe point and then save and then end the video off because I think it's been going on for far too long. And my video actually cut off, which is why that random cut was there, so, um, and we ran out of SP, so, let's save. And yeah, that's where I'm gonna end it off. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like, don't forget to subscribe, and, if you have not, and, don't forget to leave a comment. And until then, I will see you guys in the next video. This is Alpha Arceus, signing off. See you guys later, Bye 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 bye